All kinds of infection. Yeah, I think what we're going to have to do is probably build a chest in the laboratory and keep them there until we can make some kind of a... Grab the damn lines. Make some kind of a... thing for them. Still learning how to ride the horse. Sorry about that. But it's getting a little dark. I think I'm going to come back here and take a quick nap and then get up when it's light. So I'll see you in a little bit. All right. All right, guys, it's morning and it's kind of early, but that's fine. We're a little bit hungry, but I, before I went to bed, I cooked up some meat. Still got some chicken, too. So we are doing pretty darn good, food-wise. No, we don't want to sprint if we can help it, because that'll definitely tire the horse out. But this will get us around a lot quicker. Plus, this is the only way you can be in third person, so it might give us an advantage to see what's around us. Yeah, I wanted to check out here because I thought there was more than one deer. It just got a little too late. Uh, what do we got over there, guys? Okay, those are not friendlies. Yeah, those are not friendlies. Those are those monster with horns and big nasty teeth. I think we got some kind of a rabbit over there. So let's go ahead and get off of here and see what we got here, guys. We need a male. But it's got to be a European rabbit. It can't be a cottontail or a hare. I got it. Let's see. What do we got here? I hope it's a male. Let it be a male. We need a male. European hair. It is a European hair. And it is... Male. Perfect. So we've got us a female. And we've got us a male. So that's good. That is just dandy. That is just dandy, guys. Uh, I can't tell, but there's something else over there, too. And I'm going to... No. Not what I thought it was. I thought it was another animal. I think it's just some kind of a herb. Probably dandelions. Marigolds. But I'll take that, too. Alright, let's get back to our horse, because... You get a little too tired running around in this place, and it's better to ride your horse. It's better to ride your horse. Well, now we're really going to give it some galloping here. Let's see. Do we see any other critters? No, but we see some more enclosures. Here's some places that we can put the animals. Well, this isn't quite an enclosure. I think this might be a passage. Can I get through this without getting off the horse, or do I have to get... Okay, cool. That's good. I don't know if you could do that or not. Well, see, that is supposed to be an enclosure. That's interesting. That is really interesting. So I guess... Well, guys, can you get a map of this? Because I have tried to press M for map. That little thing, F1 help, pops up. But 
it really, I would like to be able to see a big overlook, you know, like where you've been, or at least things that I've explored or something. If there is a way, let me know. Maybe that's something that's yet to come. I don't know. I have a feeling I'm going to need that. Oh, now we got some monsters over there. Yeah, we're going to have to do something about the monsters. That's just all there is to it, guys. I tell you, that is something that you got to be seriously, seriously careful about. I think what I'm going to do here, I'm going to change back over to my regular arrows. Okay, I guess it's too far away. Whoa, not good. <laughs> it's mad. <laughs> oh boy, he mad. <laughs> okay, he's he's still chasing me, but I might be able to get a few more arrows in there. There we go. So it took about three arrows to take him out. See, what did I get off of him? I see I got a gore gore helmed head. It's a trophy. Hard skin and animal fat. Okay. And a corrupted heart. I always get corrupted hearts off these things. Apparently it's some kind of thing you can sell to merchants. Now, if you're playing this by yourself, I don't know if that's going to do me any good or not. But it looks like there's a couple more of these. Ugh, more than a couple. Alright, let's see if we can't... Okay, that was close. Takes about five to take one of these bastards out. Oh, shoot. Nope, I got him back. I didn't check to see if I had to grab the arrows before I picked him up, but it looks like you get your arrows back. So that's cool. Because that would royally suck. Yeah, I remember seeing something about if you didn't grab the arrows beforehand in some of the earlier versions of this, you didn't get them back. But just to be on the safe side, let's see, what have I got? How many? 43. Well, I did lose a few, but I think I missed a couple of times too. So, looks like you got one more, maybe two more. Yeah, I need to destroy that. There's an arrow over here, too. And I can't seem to get to it. Damn it. Well, at least I got rid of him. And I think that is a spawner, so I need to take it out. I think use the hammer to do that. Oh, 
Uh oh. Jeez. Pain in the. He spawned just as I was trying to destroy that damn thing. It's almost destroyed. There we go. Now we got this place to ourselves. Well, more or less. Alright, he's dead. I need to eat. This meat should do it. Alright, let's see if we can't get our arrows. Yep, you have to pick the arrows up. I thought I got the arrows back, but no, I'm down to 32 arrows, so you got to pick the arrows up. All right, we have destroyed the mutant menace. We have destroyed it. Ah, it doesn't look like I can chop this tree down. Damn it. But this looks like another good place that we could possibly build. We need a good place to build stuff, so... Chicory. Oh, cool. See any other critters out here that we could possibly tame? Oh, our horse took a nap. <laughs> ah, sweetie. There we go. Yeah, we got rid of the bad guys. You should be proud of me. You should be proud of me. Yeah, I don't know what's over here. I have been quite a few places, but... Ah, okay, I know where we are. We're to the seashore. By the sea, by the sea. By the beautiful sea. Alright, I haven't seen any animals over here at all. So, I'm not sure what, if anything, is over here, but I think I might take a little quick look over here, get on top of this little peak. Maybe we can see some other kind of animals. We're starting to get a little tired. Woo! That was fun. <laughs> Yeehaw! Okay, we got us another monster spawner over here. And... Okay. Are these the same kind of critters? It looks like it. Well, I don't really want to deal with them right at the moment. I'm just kind of doing some exploring. I don't see any other animals so far. I've seen... The last thing I... S oh, shoot. All right. 
right, looks like we are on the far side of the compound now. All right, what the hell are those? Okay, this is a different kind of monster. It walks on two legs. Okay, that's funky. Some kind <laughs> of raptor type thingy. Yeah, let's just... Let's not deal with that right at the moment. Yeah, I kind of want to see where... and what we can deal with here guys the only other way I can do that is by balloon and I might do that soon here but this is a really really big place there's those damn monsters again well, I don't think they're as fast as I am on this horse, so we're going to just ride right on by them. That should take them off. Yeah, they're not following us. <sighs> There's a lot of gravestones. Notice that. <laughs> well, we're back home. Okay, we're getting a little bit of glitching there. That's kind of weird. Ooh, there's a deer. It's another buck, but... Shoot, I scared him. I didn't mean to scare him. Damn it. Well, I don't know where he went, but... I think it's a little too hard for him to climb that. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, we need some place to keep the horse. But for now, we're just going to let him roam around right here. I am going to close this, though. That would probably be a good idea. Make sure this place stays a little bit secure. But yeah, we've got quite a few animals here. And I think we can cure them. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to come in here. Where's our little doxy friend? There he is. Hi, little man. Or little girl. Let's see. We named her. We... Now, Poppy doesn't want to go out the door. <laughs> for some reason. Anyway, I'll go ahead and grab that torch back now that I got room to do so. Alright, let's see what else we can tame here, guys. We have got. Let's tame these two rabbits because we need. That'll be our first breeding pair. Here we go. European hare. Looks like there's other types. We'll go ahead and cure that one. And we'll cure that one. There we go. And what about the fox? We'll go ahead and cure the fox too. Fox, fox, fox. There they are. Red fox. Cure. And we've got two Holsteins. It's going to be cool when we get some of these bigger animals. Holstein, 
There we go. Holstein cattle. Brown and white. Well, is it on here? It says cattle. Cattle, Holstein cattle, brown and white. Oh. I'm out of cure, aren't I? Yes. I am out of cure medicine. Gee whiz. Well, how do you make cure medicine then? Cure animals. Maybe you don't do it here. I don't know. Yep, something tells me I've got some things to learn. Chemistry table, there we go. Ah, gotcha. So, we need some cure. So to make the cure, we need an empty vial, aloe vera, Rose hips, elderberry flowers, none of which we have all of. Damn it. We'll have to go back and get it in our storage. But we do have it, guys. That's what's cool. That is cool beans, I tell you that. Poppy, why don't you come here with me? Come on. Oh, hell. I don't know how to get her out of the laboratory. Well, maybe she's just going to be a laboratory dog. <laughs> yeah, I can't pick her up. Let's see. Can I... I can't pick her up. Well, she's going to be our laboratory dog. How about that? She can stay here. She just went right through. That's creepy. <laughs> That's creepy. That's really creepy. Yeah, I think she's going to be our laboratory dog, guys. I didn't see anything about feeding and watering them, so I think she'll be all right. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that episode. That was kind of fun. That was a little bit different. We did a little bit of curing, we did a little bit of exploring, we took, killed some monsters. That was pretty awesome. Anyway guys, I guess I will be seeing you in the next episode. So please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And until then, always remember, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. I will see you later. Bye bye.